Good morning. It's Chrissy from Chrissy's Corner for Collectors. And today I'm trying to work on the eBay room. So I, if you saw in my previous videos, I'm sorry, I'm trying to get this up here. If you saw in my previous videos, basically what I did was I lettered each shelf and gave everybody a number. And let me show you, you saw this. Okay, an inventory number and a shelf. Here's the thing, after moving, I realized that's not really efficient. So uh, we're gonna do something a little bit different. Everything's still gonna get a category number, but let me show you what I've done so far. Okay, so this is gonna be the new eBay room and it is much smaller than our other eBay room. So I had to be creative. So. What I've decided to do, because sometimes some of the items that are on have been on for a couple of years, and that was before our inventory changed how we were going to do it. So some of these things don't have a shelf number. So I'm kind of, just, I was just putting them anywhere. So we kind of did it this way. I know I've said kind of a couple of times. So we've got all our racks and this one's pulled away from the wall because I'm working on it. So how I'm going to organize this is by holidays so this shelf and this shelf will be holiday things trees glass angels halloween ornaments things like that in the back there you see those bins they say pins buckles so whenever we sell belt buckle or pin um it's in there also some bigger items we pre-box, and I'm just gonna keep them in the box and put them up high. As long as I mark them, people will know what they are. Okay, so going down, I have figurines back there, but that shelf's gonna be too small for figurines, so I'm going to move them. And then I have two empty shelves here. This one is gonna be all mugs and thermoses. This one I don't know what I'm gonna do with yet. Now, I'm going to pan around. So, we've got our smalls back here. And then over here, I made a, um, vases and collectibles and barware. So, like, this is barware in here, and it's a caddy, and it's all wrapped up. I'm not taking that out. Down here is going to be pottery. And way down here is, like, sports, tent stuff, sporting goods. And then I've got all my salt and peppers in that basket right there. Now, over here, what we have is a kid's bedroom set that we got when my grandson was living with us. And so in here are all the supplies. So we've saved all the paper I used for wrapping and packing. I'm folding it back up, putting it in here. Some of it, there was a, in this closet, there's a, a rod. So I'm putting it back over the rod. In here will be all mailers as soon as I organize them. Anything on eBay that is a linen or shirt or clothing. And in these drawers are mailers and tape. Fragile tape. But what's nice is this table can fit right up against it. And so even though this room is smaller, I'm getting a lot in here. So that rack is going to go against the wall. I may put one more rack here. Or I may put one rack behind the door and just you won't be able to open the door all the way. Not quite sure yet. But either way, I still have a lot of shelving open. Um, it's very bright in here because of the fan. I don't think we'll be able to use the fan because I'm afraid we'll knock something off the shelf. And then, um, oh, and down here are books and linens and things like that. And this is like housewares and small tools. The only thing I'm worried about is the tools that Billy has on eBay because he has a lot of tools. Now, they may go down there if I don't use it, but we're going to put those in last. And again, anything that comes that was wrapped up individually in a box that comes out is going to go right on top and just be marked. So I think I've got the layout pretty good. Um, I will make little signs to put in front in case he forgets where everything is. And, of course, we do have to paint eventually because it's a mess in here. But I think I think we're on the road. I think we're on the road. 
Um, and I've got a lot more to unpack, but I did want to show you my eBay room and how things are moving along. Now, under here, I think what I'm going to do is some of the boxes we had, like these, that have some little, little boxes, I think I'm going to store them just under there in case we sell something. And um, also, anything that I found that wasn't listed is going in a clear box in the other room. And it's going to be called the death box. Because this way, if we see it in the other room all the time, we'll list stuff. If it sits back here, we won't. So, yeah. Um, I'm moving along. And, uh, yeah. I'm excited. Thanks, guys. I hope you have a great day.